Recent ransomware cyber attacks have delivered a wake-up call for corporate America. We have heard from the highest level officers at organizations asking us, what do we do? What is the landscape? What is coming next? How do we prepare? News 8 on your side reached out to 15 of the world's largest cybersecurity firms to ask if they have seen an increase in businesses asking about cybersecurity measures. Ten companies responded and described the current demand from businesses, large and small, as exceptional, unprecedented, and historic. They're focusing on things that maybe had been budgeted for six, 12 months out. They're doing them today. Proofpoint Cybersecurity surveyed 1,400 chief information security officers around the world and shared their report with News 8 on your side. Healthcare has been targeted by a number of ransomware attacks, so News 8 also reached out to the four largest healthcare providers in our area, UPMC, Wellspan, Penn Medicine, and Penn State Hershey, to find out how they are protecting themselves from ransomware attacks. In response, we received a single statement from the president of the Hospital Association of Pennsylvania, who told us hospitals and health systems continue to ramp up their infrastructure and are educating their workers to ensure the protection of their facilities and patients. While beefing up infrastructure, companies are also entering the market for cyber insurance coverage. We have seen an increasing uh, rate of adoption into businesses looking to buy cyber insurance over the last six months. Jack Kudel is the CEO of cyber insurance provider Cowbell Cyber. He tells News 8 that right now, no more than 10% of businesses have cyber insurance. Cyber risk is the greatest threat to our economy. Uh, it's the next digital pandemic. Better computer infrastructure and insurance can help companies be prepared for ransomware, but it could all be undone by indecision. You must, as an organization, as an executive team, have that decision made far before you ever encounter any ransomware. That decision needs to be made today. Brian Roach on your side, WGAL News 8.